What's up guys, today's video is sponsored by New Air. They just sent us their Magic Chef Air Fryer. All right, so we're about to head up to the grocery store. We're gonna do a little taste tester. We're gonna do some Air Fryer BS Oven. Right. There you go. And see what we can do. We're gonna get ourselves some homemade yeah. French fries. Mm, we're gonna get ourselves garlic. some of those delicious frozen rallies and checkers fries. And see what it's all about. My fave, put some in the oven, some in the air fryer, and see what the best uh, maneuver is. So let's head to the grocery store, cue the montage. Got what we needed, headed back to the apartment. Today, this bad boy, the New Air Magic Chef Air Fryer, is bringing you some number six with cheese loaded fries. You excited? I'm excited. Watch your fingies. Careful. Careful. Watch your fingies. fingies. Fingies accounted for. Fingies accounted for. Yank it. Boom. Boom. You got it? I got it. I got, I got it. it. I got it. I got the baby. Woo! Recipe book. Boom! We did it. That's how you open a package. Like an idiot. You're an idiot. We got the air fryer. We got the potatoes. Now it's time for the prep work. Yeah. In the front row, kicking back old school trash like damn. Can't get enough of this more like I don't need no right. To the beat, let's go, cause this is our jam. This is our jam. Let's go. Uh, let me break it down right quick for my haters, my dictators, and bad raiders. Since you never seem to get it right no more, they're right no more. Got the fries in there. Pop it in, goes on, boom. Power, mode, go over to fries, sets it at 400. Got it right in there, boom, bam, boom. We got the air fryer fries going about 17, 18 minutes. We got the oven fries going probably 30 to 40 minutes. This is faster, we'll pretty them up at the end, see which one tastes better, that's what matters. Bridge, my mama told me do to do no entiendo. All I ever heard was noise over my Nintendo. But when you get the chance to go up in this life, make sure that you take it, never ever think twice, yeah. And if you wanna get higher, pick up the mic and get to rapping cause you're never getting higher. Yeah. In the front row, kicking back old school trash like damn. Can't get enough of this more like I don't even know where I am. Ooh, baby, get hyped to the beat. Let's go cause this is our jam. This is our jam. We got ourselves some number six with cheese fries here. What do we got on there, Shawnee boy? All right, so we got the base, we cut up the fries, right? We got green onions, we got jalapenos, we got garlic aioli, we got a whole bunch of cheddar cheese, and then the seasonings that Sean and Corey like to use, garlic powder, garlic salt, chili powder, crushed red pepper, salt, pepper, all the good. Gotta love it, gotta love it. So I think today, first, we start with what we know. We know oven fries very well. Let's start, these are the same ingredients on both, both same fries. Ingredients but don't let look, level. Looks are all the same to me right now. Yeah, look. so it looks very similar, but the taste, the crispiness, that's what we're after. Yeah, we're trying to see what's actually better, huh? Oven fries, let's do it. All right, let's do it. All right, I'm diving right in. Yeah, heck yeah, it's a good one. I'm gonna get one with a little bit of I want a little bit, a little bit of everything on Yeah, the, the look of a fry that you're really looking for, the thing you want, you want a little bit of all of it on that fry. A nice variety. Yeah. Ooh, I got a good one. So you see that? You got a bunch of green onion, jalapeno. All right, oven fries, the number six with cheese oven fries. Cheers. Cheers. I mean, it's pretty good. It's good, really good flavor. I do like that a lot. But when you're doing steak fries, especially what we did, we did like thicker cut steak right. fries. There's a little bit of softness in the middle and not as much crispness as maybe a restaurant would And we probably could have left, we already left these in for what? 45 minutes. Yeah, so you can get the middle done on the oven, but it's just gonna take an hour and a half, That's right? the thing that's tough, is like these took so, so long. These did take way Fried Potatoes take a long time in the oven. That's right. But they are really good, man. We put great ingredients on that's true. Because we're a dope food channel. <laughs> Alright, these air fryer ones out? Yeah, now so the ones we cooked in the air fryer. New air, magic chef, yep. air fryer fries. Yeah, same ingredients, but just a little bit more, hopefully, crisp to it. Ooh, I got a lot of cheese on this bad boy. Look at this. The way we did this. Look at mine. Oh yeah. Look at mine right there. 
Look at that. It's filled up to holy heaven. All right, air fryer fries. You air fryer. Ready? Ready. Six with cheese. Cheers. Mmm. That's really good. It's just more of a crisp to it. 100% I could tell the middle. When you were talking about the middle, those being Middle's kind of, cooked more. I'm gonna get a couple of these. There's like a charredness mm. to the edge yeah. of the air fryer ones. You can see how, you can really taste a little bit. Like, oh, it's man. amazing how. All right, I need to do some back to back. Yeah, yeah. Have one and then have the other. Two of these. I'm gonna even do a dress down one. Yeah, me too. Here's my oven. It's kind of soft. Here. Oh my God, that is seriously a big difference. Right? It crunches out of the air fryer. And they look exactly the same. Exactly. I'm dead serious, that's a, that's a big difference in flavor to me. So here's a little thing. So I've been using a Magic Chef air fryer at my apartment for like the past few months. Like a fan sent me one of those, mm -hmm. right? We use it for literally everything that will fit inside of it. So like if you're, you're making- using it all the time? If you're making any frozen food stuff, if you're cutting up potatoes for hash browns or fries or whatever, mm -hmm. it's faster, it's crispier, it just works. Dude, I gotta tell you, when I first ate those, I was like, those are so good. Right, then you have this. I was worried that this wasn't gonna match up. I was like, oh man, I know it's a sponsored bit or whatever, but those are pretty gosh darn good. I know. But seriously, it, it crazy how those cook it more thoroughly and it was in like the time that you can save is seriously freakish. So these took about like, I'm not kidding, 18 minutes. Mm -hmm. We had to leave the oven one in for what, 45 to 50 minutes. It's like three times the amount. All right, so here's the kicker. Oh my God. Here's the kicker, right? So we cut these up. We bought a bunch of ingredients from the grocery store, like green onions and jalapenos. So here's the best part. I can't get over the difference in between one from the other. It's seriously <laughs> so good. We love frozen foods. Wow. We'll normally just throw that in. Oh, I know where you're going with this. Watch this. So you can even throw frozen fries inside one of these things and it's life changing. We love Corey, we love famous fries from Checkers and Rallies. That's the truth. You know we do. So you literally toss these babies in here like this, how they look so good. And I'm not kidding you, in like 15 minutes, they're way better than the oven. Way better. A few minutes later. Boom! So these are the rally, checkers and rallies fries. Which I love, I get these all the time. I just these were in there weekend. for, dude, I'm not kidding you, 12 minutes. <laughs> and these, because these are thinner, these are crispy mm -hmm. as hell. Oh yeah, these are super crispy. So I make these all the time in the oven because I've never owned an air fryer. Right. I am. I promise you these taste better than the oven ones that I usually get. How long do you have to put these in in the oven? If I want it to be crispy, 25, 30. Yeah. Uh -huh. Wow. Wow. So that was the whole thing for me is because I've been using an air fryer for three, four months. You knew. It bloomed. I've been literally, how many times have I told you? I'm like, I don't understand how it works as well as it does. So this one that we use today, it holds 5.6 quarts of stuff. Massive. Mass, way bigger than the one that I use. That's pretty big. Which is amazing. It has like digital temperature temperature controls, it knows how much is in there, it bases it off that. Mm. Which is seriously crazy because, so you just throw those in there. Right. Does it know the temperature already? It, literally, you, you turn it the on, product, be like, I was like, potatoes, fries. yeah. And then it just goes 18 minutes based off of what you put in there. It like weighs Boom. it out or something, it's got, it's you got can easily, future, you can like pull it out. Technology in yeah, there. you can pull it out and look at it and be like, all right, I'm putting a little bit more salt, whatever, and put it back in there. It just like intuitive and knows oh, what you're that. doing. I thought you had to like, like I'm used to where I cook, I have to set the timer on the microwave. You gotta, dude, it does it for you. It knows if oh, you're making potatoes, so it knows the cool, temperature. Dude. Like, it does all of that for you. That's pretty sick. Hey, man. You're a part of the family now. Welcome to the family, stepson. Welcome to being a sixer. Air fryer. Be a part of it. <laughs> Welcome to our family. I know it's sponsored, but you never lie. On the count of three, fryer or oven? All right, I'm in. One, two, three, fryer! Duh. Right? I mean, seriously, I'm not BSing. It's that's very hard to go back to an oven in this scale after you've done Especially when you factor in the speed. It's crazy that you can take a third of the time and make more delicious stuff. If you guys have any recipes that you want us to try in our brand new air fryer, please link those below, comment, any of that stuff. If you guys swear by air fryers, let us know. We're we're kind of newer to the game. You know? Let these guys know. If you want to pop on their social media yeah. and tell them, hey, saw the number six with cheese video, loved it. Mm -hmm. Let them know. Hey, somebody off camera wants to throw a fry at Corey. Oh. Ew. Oh, <laughs> nobody needed that, obviously. We'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new video. Thank you to New Air for letting us try out one of their best air fryers on the market. Thank you. And shout out Thank to you. that. Thank you for supporting number six with cheese. Guys, it's been real. We're gonna eat all these fries and then literally buy a treadmill. Peace. If you've been wanting an air fryer, now's the time to do it! New Air is offering fans of number six with cheese 20% off the Magic Chef air fryer model we used in today's video. Just enter that code cheese for that sweet, sweet discount. All links are below this video to make your checkout stupidly easy. Seriously guys, do it. We'll see you tomorrow for a brand new video. Bye.